Now the value of Afghanistan's currency is tumbling, exacerbating the severe economic crisis and deepening poverty in a country where more than half the population already does not have enough to eat. The Afghani lost more than 11 percent of its value against the U.S. dollar in the space of a day in earlier December before recouping. But the market remains volatile and the devaluation is already impacting Afghans. Afghanistan's economy was already troubled when the international community froze billions of dollars worth of Afghanistan's assets abroad and stopped all international funding to the country after the Taliban assumed power in mid-August amid a chaotic U.S. and NATO troop withdrawal. The consequences have been dire for a country heavily dependent on foreign aid. According to the United Nations World Food Program, 22.8 million Afghans out of Afghanistan's 38 million people already face acute food insecurity and malnutrition in the country. A combination of the coronavirus pandemic, a severe drought and the Taliban takeover have left many without jobs and the currency's sliding value has been pushing up food prices. In the bedlam of the Herat money exchange market, traders frantically check the ever-changing currency rate on their mobile phones as they jostle through the crowd, shouting out prices and waving wads of cash. A taser-wielding guard keeps the entrance free from the crush, the sound of its sharp clicks enough to send money changers scurrying past into the exchange. He sold U.S. dollars at a rate of 105 Afghanis, but then bought at 113 as the currency began to slide and he worried it might fall even further. The Afghani was trading at around 80 to the dollar in early August before the Taliban take over, jumping to around 90 in October. But now on Monday, December the 20th, the Afghani was trading at around 102 to the dollar.